Hello guys, today I want to talk to you about this uh, Google product that is called Google Voice and this product I have used it for a number of years also probably since around 2008 so I have had this product and if they have the Android app and I think they also have an app in some other mobile operating systems and the way Google Voice works is um, you set up the Google Voice application and you can make calls but not from your mobile phone number so the person who sees your call won't see your let's say actual phone number so this is convenient for a number of reasons one of them being privacy you so you can have your actual phone number you know concealed from people that you don't want them to know your actual phone number and another possible use for google voice is that you can call us phone numbers even if you are not physically located in the US and this has the advantage of having access to phone numbers or yes customer service that is located in the US the way the Google Voice application works is that you need to have to set up the application you need to have a US phone number so there is a way to get around this for example if you don't live in the US and you let's say live abroad but you don't have a mobile phone number from the US and the way to do this is to use um, some virtual phone number or a VOIP phone number and I have used um, some phone phone applications that are able to do this but let's explain a little bit how it works for example if you have the Google Voice application installing your phone you call uh, a certain phone number and you get a call back from Google so they they call back the phone number that you sign up with and then after you pick up the call then you are connected with your original phone number that you were going to call about and you you don't see or they don't see that you are calling from a different phone number so the Google Voice it has instructions on how can you do the the setup and you can use um, Google Voice with different um, let's say services that are part of the Google environment so you can use also Hangouts if you are going to use Google Voice only with Hangouts you don't need a callback number you can just do it directly from the application from the Hangouts application but you don't have also a phone number that you will be able to give to people so you cannot receive calls is not so useful and the way you do it is um, you know they then they have this information on the Google Voice help so they can tell you what things you can do with voice for example you can also text from your mobile phone or from the Hangouts application you can receive text as well to this virtual phone number that they will assign to you um, they have this uh, very useful feature where they use uh, voice recognition and they transcribe the voicemail so if someone leaves you a voicemail they will transcribe these so you can have like an idea of what was the content of the actual message it's usually not perfect it has like a lot of errors especially the person has a certain accent or they are not speaking very clearly you cannot make up exactly what they were trying to say but I'll, most of the time you have at least a good idea of what they were trying to do and 
Another one that is also very useful is that it helps you to um, control the spam calls so you have you know a better way to filter uh, calls from people that you don't know so you can personalize the voicemail greetings you can set up groups so if you have your contacts that you know that they are reliable persons or reliable business you can set up groups that will go straight without being screened and if there is someone that you don't know they usually need to say who they are so you can kind of screen the calls before you can actually take the call and otherwise you can just go to voicemail so you can you know have this very useful feature and as they say here you need to have a Google account and you need to have a US phone number so you will use this for the callback and you have to have of course a computer or smartphone with internet access additionally you can do also international calls if you just add some credit to the account so you can use this with Google Play Google Pay and you will have some credit unfortunately yes yet you cannot do international text but uh, you can do US and Canada text for free and you can usually have almost all calls for free in the US there are, they say here that the, there are some calls that you need to actually spend one cent a minute but that's usually not the case and they have very affordable prices for example to you can see the list of uh, countries and here in the help uh, pages from Google so you can have an idea of how this works and this is one of the apps that I can recommend I have used it for a number of years I have some other apps before but this one has been working very reliably so we when you sign up for text now you have the option to have a desktop application so you can use it in your laptop for example or you can just have um, a phone app and they assign you a, a number and with this number you can use it as a callback number for Google Voice so you can have the service full service and you can use this anywhere in the world as long as you have you know internet connection you can pick up the calls anywhere you are they also have some features that there are premium features the basic features of uh, text now are for free so you can text and call online for free and they will give you a free phone number a US phone number and they have some other options where you can just call and text with some other features if you're based in the US they have some other hybrid technologies where they will use actually smartphones for for some extra features they have even um, now they recently started sell, selling phones and plans so if you're based in the US you can have more services than some people have you can also call internationally and they have usually good rates as well I haven't used that service much but I can tell you for sure that the free phone number works very reliably and I think you just need to text at least once every few days or every few weeks to keep the phone number active and you can even transfer your number if you have already a phone number so you can have different options for this and here the text now app is available in the app store or for Google Play for Android and 
can also have it for some devices that still have the Microsoft operating system. So what you can do is you can have certain apps um, option that you can call. For example, you can text in here in the section where it says conversations. You can place calls and you have different options. So you can just use it in Chrome or have the Hangout Styler, you know, the Android app and the iOS app. So you can use all of these services online. Additionally, you can you can make calls directly from Gmail on the website. So if you have a Gmail account, you can take um, this feature that you can call and have some chat features from, from directly from the Gmail. And this is something that they started in 2010, so it's been a while. Of course, you need to give some permissions for your computer, microphone and speakers, but after this, you, you, you will be able to do this. And you don't need to call someone who has Gmail, you can just call the phone, like US phones, or if you have credit, you can call a phone number directly, so it won't be a problem. And that's it. It is uh, a very convenient application, especially for people that live abroad uh, or someone who is even traveling. I have used this extensively when you're traveling and the ability to receive text is also very useful. For example, I have used uh, WhatsApp or Viber or Telegram, which are messaging applications, and I sign up with the um, Google Voice number, so it doesn't matter where I, where am I in the world, I can just sign up with my Google Voice number and I will be able to maintain contact with people, for example, for more than 10 years and I haven't changed my mobile phone number for these apps for a long time and this is something that is very convenient. You can also receive travel notifications, so you're traveling and you don't have access because your local phone number from the US doesn't have roaming in the country where you're traveling to. Um, as long as you have internet connection, you can still receive notifications uh, from your bank accounts for your next connection, for your flight connection. So it's a very useful feature. I hope you like it. So that's it guys. If you like this video and want to see more from this channel, Please like the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel and hit the notification bell so you can get a notification every time a new video is released. And leave a comment if you have any questions or just uh, want to suggest new content. So that's it. Thank you for watching.